Oh, it's been dry out there this morning for most of us. Quite a lot of cloud, but some brightness and sunshine coming through. And this afternoon, we've actually got a warm front moving through, and that's going to produce some bits and pieces of rain. But we should still have a bit of brightness as well, even where we have the thicker cloud. Probably the best of the breaks in the cloud later on, coming in from the west and northwest. And it's still mild out there. Top temperatures are 14 to 16 degrees Celsius. 16 is 61 degrees Fahrenheit. With the southwest winds just tending to pick up a bit through this afternoon. So tonight we will have some clear sky for a time before the next lot of cloud and eventually some rain starts to push down from the northwest. We stay on the mild side, temperatures tonight no lower than about 8 or 9 degrees Celsius. In fact, some of us are likely to stay in double figures around 10 or 11 degrees Celsius. And we've still got those southwesterly winds. But this rain is associated with this cold front, which will stink steadily southeastwards during tomorrow morning and behind it much colder air. So we start off on the cloudy side with spells of rain moving southeastwards and then behind it well, we transition to something much brighter with some sunshine and probably a few showers but it's going to feel noticeably colder. Quite a shock to the system after all the mild weather we've had. Temperatures tomorrow at best around 11 or 12 degrees Celsius, so much closer to average, and it will feel particularly chilly in those northwesterly winds, which will be quite blustery at times. And talking of winds, well, over the weekend, they're going to pick up further still. In fact, we could have gusts stronger than this, up to around 40 miles an hour in places. So it really will feel quite cold in that wind. Saturday, quite a few showers, and some of those could be heavy, perhaps even producing some thunder and hail. But by Sunday, the showers are likely to be much more isolated, so a lot more in the way of fine and dry weather, even though it is going to be on the windy side. And then Monday, the next lot of rain pushing in from the west, we're just not quite sure when. Bliss.